Okay, recently a few people asked me, um, what does it take to start up a YouTube channel? Um, and, you know, obviously a lot of people hit those terms on YouTube and you'll probably find so many videos with millions of views on it. And, um, you know, these are highly successful guys out there who've been in the game for 10 years. So when they come around and tell you 10 years later, this is what you should be doing. This is what you should be using. Um, when I was doing the research, what I found was half the time it doesn't make any sense. It's just pure nonsensical um, stuff that they tell you. So I want to kind of uh, make it a bit easier. No offense to the guys. I mean, obviously they've worked for 10 years, right? So, you know, if they get the success <clears throat> and they're getting the views, right? Why not? By all means. So, you know, I just want to make it more simple, right? So what does it take to be a YouTuber? What does it take for you to make YouTube videos? It's a simple truth, actually. A lot of people just won't tell you. Um, and I'm just going to put it out there. To be a, 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 you know, a YouTuber, number one thing you're going to need is a YouTube channel, obviously. So make yourself a YouTube channel. Don't worry about the branding. You can change all of those later. A lot of people get too um, kind of, um, how would I say, too, too much, too occupied trying to basically get all of everything perfect. Do you know what? The best videos, the best performing videos are the least perfect videos, right? Because you're showing your natural abilities there. Um, so, you know, like if you want to do, it depends on what kind of content you do. So you might do content that people will watch over and over. That will be helpful many years down the line. It could be a how to video. So, you know, loads of people will see that. Those are known as evergreen videos, right? Just like an evergreen tree where the leaves stay green forever. So those ones you can have forever. So it depends on those kind of uh, thing. Um, what are the content I do most times are not evergreen. They are more for this particular day. So, you know, each, you can have a different category. Also, you'll have a lot of people say, oh, consistency is the key. Not entirely, actually. Um, you can have a channel where you do daily stuff or up to the minute or you do live stuff. But you can also have evergreen stuff in there. You can also drop a little bit of an um, how to. Because what's going to happen is your viewers who are searching for those terms are going to come. So more important than anything else is you make a video and you, you choose, right, is it for today? Is it for, you know, this month? Is it for this year? You know, or is it forever, right? So those are the things you have to understand. Once you've made that video, you also need to understand your keywords, your title, right? You can have a video today um, that's an evergreen video and 10 years down the line, someone will watch it. I've got people on one of my channels People subscribe to me even today when I tell them don't subscribe. I'm on a new channel now. I'm starting a brand new channel. So please come to that channel. Um, and I've got more subscribers there. And even then, uh, people are constantly subscribing because they like the content, right? They like the craziness that I've got on the other channel. And I'm not mentioning that here. So I've had my experience in the game. I understand it. And for this channel, it's a brand new channel. Um, and, uh, you know, it's been growing gradually. So don't worry too much about it. Don't worry about how many views you got. Don't worry about anything. Just do what you want to do. Just put it out there, all right? Um, I'm going to give you a little bit of biblical thing there. Like Noah, you built the ark, they will come, right? So you got to do the work, people will come. And as I said, make sure you know what your content is relative to. Is it relative to today? Is it relative to this week? Is it relative to this month? Is it relative to this year? Because some people might do a, uh, say, a gadget review, but the gadget's only relevant for this year. Um, some people might do something, um, you know, how to do something or how to cook something. That could be forever. So choose your content, do your thing, um, and then they will come. Don't worry too much about it. Um, so I'm hoping like, you know, this helps and you're like, I think the biggest question is, is what equipment, right? You won't believe this if I tell you your mobile phone is the only equipment you need. As long as you have a good lighting, so as long as, you know, you can do it next to a window, right? Just a good lighting. You need a bit of a quiet room. Here you'll find I'm not quite, uh, it's, the room is not that quiet because I'm actually near a window. However, my window is open to let in some fresh air. 
and I'm next to a road. So because of that, I've got cars moving and you can actually probably pick it up in the microphone. And also I'm at home, so I've got people moving around as well in their household. So they're also making sounds um, and, the, and the microphone that I'm using is picking it up. But I didn't um, start off with all of this. I started off a mobile phone. If you go back to some of the things, even though I had these equipment, and I've never used them as for the uh, filming YouTubes. I just did it on my phone. I mean, most videos, I just did it while my phone was kind of docked on my car while I'm driving. So there's no scripts, there's nothing. I'm not doing anything. I'm just breaking every single rules, right? Because, the, the you know, the most common um, thing that is sold to you is uh, that you have to have a script, you have to know what you're doing. And it's all about being professional. But the guys, you've had 10 years experience and now you're advising us it doesn't work like this. What was your first video like, <laughs> right? So I think a lot of people don't really help the beginners. And for the beginners, all I'm gonna say, your mobile phone, a quiet room is enough. Trust me, your microphone there these days, you know, year 2021 or even the 2020, uh, the mobile phones that you had, is actually very good quality sounds, very good quality cameras. Just use that. Don't worry too much about it. Don't worry about a script. Get your stuff ready. You will get to that stage. You know, you'll get to that stage um, after, you know, if you do it for a few years, you start liking it. Try to give it a go because some people are not cut out for it. They just don't have the patience. With YouTube, all these successful channels, they took them many years. There's only one channel that actually became successful within one year. Um, but other than that, many, many channels took many, many years. And even that particular guy who became successful, and I'll talk about him on another video if you want. Leave your comments below if you want me to talk about that. He became successful because he followed three other channels and he combined what those three channels do. And then he took it further, basically. Um, so it's, I mean, it's a good technique. There's nothing wrong with that. He didn't know what to do. So he said, okay, I know these guys are doing very well. So I'll take these top three companies and, you know, top three um, um, YouTubers and copy what they do and combine it in one and make myself successful. And it worked. So you can do that as well. So it's, it's it, as I said, it's, it's up to you, but you most, you know, most of the time, all you need is a mobile phone. And then over time, the more confident you get, the more comfortable you get, you can start building your gear. You can start getting yourself a good microphone. You can get yourself a good camera. Um, you can get yourself a good laptop. You don't need any of those. Nowadays, you can quickly shoot a video and edit with a few filters and this and that directly on your mobile phone's camera app. If you want to take it one step further, you can actually then download other apps that allow you to edit videos and put sound effects and whatnot. You can also do that. Um, YouTube has a massive library of free music that you can actually put onto your videos. You can do that. So most of these, actually, you don't even need a laptop. You don't need any equipment. You can do it. But if you want to go, once you get comfortable and you want to start investing and you want to go one step further, then yes, you need to go to the computer. I need to um, start editing on the computer or something like this. Um, I'll give you a good example of my edits. I don't use an editing software. I, I literally, if I have a cut or something I need to do or I need to add some music or something, I literally do it on the, uh, so I'm using a MacBook currently, I do it on an iMac, uh, sorry, the iMovie, right? The iMovie application literally does it for me. I'm doing a basic cut. I'm not doing these high, I'm not making a movie here. This is not gonna be an evergreen video. This is here now and then, that's it. So for me, this is perfect. Make it short, make it sweet, um, make the video, do the cut, done. I don't need extra filters or anything. Um, some of the other settings that I've got is to control my music levels and everything. I've actually inputted everything into OBS. If you guys want me to make something on OBS, then make sure to comment below, hit the like, subscribe and hit the bell button and let me know. I will make something on uh, how I use OBS um, so you can understand how I'm using the open broadcast software um, to record and enable some functions that I would have done later, kind of minimizing my editing. So right now you're probably hearing it a, a background music that background music is actually already embedded into the video via OBS so let me know anyway but as I said guys to start off YouTube all you need to do is just get your content out there it could be anything it could be absolutely anything it doesn't matter it takes time YouTube is very very cruel right from experience very cruel with us new guys it doesn't give us the exposure that we require, but that's fine. You just got to constantly put your content out there 
and then you get there at some point. So don't worry too much about it. That's all I'm gonna say. So kind of more of an encouragement video. I want you guys to get out there, try your best, um, but don't even try, actually, don't even try. I, I, scrap that, don't try. Just get out there, make the video, and put the video out there. That's it, don't worry, okay? And you can use a mobile phone to do this upgrade later and i'll go on this more detail on another video so i'm just gonna make it short now i hope you guys like what you saw i hope you understand that all you need is a mobile phone something as simple as this and it does your job right so uh until another one guys and let me know in the comments obviously uh hit the like subscribe if you haven't already um and let me know what you want to see and uh, we'll see you on another one take care bye bye